Jesus Christ! It's the wrong way! <laughs> yes! Yes! Aren't you a great doggy? Five-star combination that no promised me. Legit rocket. Oh my god, it's a bearded dragon! I freaking watch this dodge. You are. Uh, Yikes! Why are you running? I just want to be buddies! Whoa, 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 Well, gents, first night, it was a cold one, wasn't it, Nerb Yeah, it was really cold, pretty cold. Two degrees it got down to last night. That's where it, the bivvy comes in on its own. It's quite warm, the old bivvy. You just uh, generate a lot of your own heat inside it. And my Cedar Summit Spark 3 sleeping bag um, was good. Out in the desert, it gets super cold, so be warm in the daytime but I've learnt it's the freaking coldest place in the freaking earth at night time and we had some emus run past last night that was a funny sound and uh, can't see many kangaroos just yet but I reckon they're out there well gents this is where we camped right near this big cool lakey thing just gonna have a look to see if there's any kangaroos or emus there's a fire I can't even see where the fire was Hashtag leave no trace. How's it going, bud? Hey, Skippy. That is a kangaroo. Hoppity hop. Hoppity hop. This is a small one. Hey, bud. Where you going? Where you going? Coming for ya. Coming for ya. Hoppity hop. Hop. We're going this way, are we? Going Hoppity hop, hoppity hop, hop, hop. I love chasing kangas. Except when I run into shit. Uh. Oh, there's a dead kangaroo. Go, 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 go! Go this way, go this way! Turn right, turn right! No, I can't get you in the bush! See you, skip! Oh, through the trees. You've got a lazy morning wheelie, eh? Bit of a wake up wheelie? Shitty road. Here we go. Bit of sand. Let's do sand at 42 psi. So this is known as Nerb's tree. This is uh, where he comes with his his ladies of the night, and they all leave their bras on the tree after full of underwear and shit. <laughs> Just bras and panties and ugh. think of the STDs in this tree ugh. gross good job Neb look at the bra <laughs> granny ones grey nomads all grey nomads <laughs> far out Neb's doing 300 in the sand chill the freak out Nerd's a psychopath! This is good. This is like the Stress Lucky track. And when we first went to The Simpson, we did the Stress Lucky track, which is like this. And we thought The Simpson was going to be like this. That's why we were so confident. Um, the Stress Lucky track's freaking easy, man. You can do it 60, 100 k's an hour the whole way. Um, <laughs> then you get into The Simpson, you're like, oh, it's not the same. They're doing 10 k's an hour, like, Whoa! freaking all over the shop. No freaking grip on your front wheel. We are in the desert now, soft sand. This is great. We're in the Denangi, Delangi, we're in South Australia Conservation Park. 
red sand a lot of it. Quite a few k's to get through this national park. So gotta kinda of, gotta boot along. Still on road pressures, 42 psi front, 42 psi rear. It's a little skatey but this uh this road's pretty easy. No dramas. No dramas mate. This is the shit I live for though man. Out in the middle of the desert. Speeding along, 100 k's an hour, 6 gear, red sand. This is Australia, mate. This is freaking Australia. Just need to hit a kangaroo and then it'll be as Aussie as it gets. Ooh, soft sand. Punch it. Power! Stay on the taps. <laughs> Just got a, the Toby Price approach. Just gas it. See if anyone's home in the old shed. Hello. Whoa. This is where I'm going to sit and write my memoir. Write my fancy memoir. Anyone know any home? No one's home. Save up and buy this house. If I stop eating avocado toast. Broken. Classic 690. Shouldn't want a KTM. Rock around. My clutch is gone. No way. It's, well, it's, it's like I've got no clutch. As in, no pressure? Yeah, no resistance. I have to see if there's fluid in there. Yeah. Yeah, like happened suddenly or? No, or just, you know, when we stopped for that little break there. Yeah. And then just riding along there and just coming through here, I just tried to go back and I just felt it was very light. That yeah. was the last, yeah. Yeah, nothing. nothing well, there's not much of a reservoir, is there? Yeah, the KDM strikes again. Strikes <laughs> again. Classic 690. You can see there's a bit of oil. Hopefully that's it's just right there. Yeah. Ow! That is hot. Hot. Yeah. The old exhaust. The old exhaust. <laughs> 11 mil spanner. Yep. 11. Oh, nice. That's what it is. Is that a common Austrian size nerb? No, I think I've got it out of my... Oh. Actually, we, we, we'll, we'll see. Uh. The beer bottles drop out of my... Uh... You bloody drunkard. <laughs> Call the cops on you. Ugh, Jesus, Christ. Ugh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus. <laughs> Freaking hell, man. That's more than all my camping gear combined. Yeah, but I could rebuild your motor from here. True, but I'll drive a Yamaha, so I don't need to. <laughs> good times, good times 12, 13, in the desert. 10, 10, 14, 15. Fill your syringe. Yeah. Tie that around your arm, Nerb, so you get your vein prepped. <laughs> He'll load up the uh, like the shot for you. Bit of H in the old morning. <laughs> <laughs> Early morning hammer. <laughs> How much did it take you, remember? Oh, good couple of syringes, I think. This is some advanced bush mechanics here. Chemistry. Oh, let's see if it'll there we go, we're on. Okay. Oh, it's just bubbles coming out. Is there? Yeah. Good. Keep going. Still bubbles. It's even making noises. Bush mechanics. I reckon that'll buff out. Woo! <laughs> Emus! Hello! <laughs> hey, buddies. I freaking love emus, they're the best man. They're good at emus, eh? So, uh, we kind of didn't calculate uh, the distance between where we camped, which is Renmark, and uh, Yunta, uh, which is where we're heading to now. Uh, we 
thought it was like 260 k's. It turned out to be uh, 350 k's of, you know, a medium soft sand. And uh, my bike has only got, so 260, I'm like, oh, it's fine. My bike's got 300 k's of range, no problem. Uh, you know, even with sand, it should be right. But uh, yeah, now it's 350 k's uh, in, you know, sub the sand that we thought it was going to be. So I'm right now, I'm running incredibly low on fuel. Luckily, no behind me, but you can fill up one bladder, one of his small bladders, four litres of fuel. So out of 14 litres, I generally get 300 k's out of it. I've never really pushed it before, but um, right now I'm on 280 kilometres. I need to get low. First car that we've seen all day. So it's like 3 p.m. right now. I've been riding since like 9 a.m. This is the first car I've seen all day. No blankers, but a 200 series. Not the 70 series, which I thought it would be. She's dead. Oh, come on, I can see the town. She didn't make it. Come on! Dead. I oh, know. No, I won't make it. So freaking close. I probably could have made it, but I don't want to run my fuel pump dry, and it was stuttering. 350k's out of under 14 litres. Yunta. I swear I've been here before. I always feel like I've been to these. I have! Yes! We went that way to Akarula. Yeah. Definitely been here before. Alrighty, gents. We're going to camp here tonight. I guess Gnerb can find some trees in there. Or even here. This is where we're going to camp tonight. Sun's going down. A couple of k's out of town. And, uh... Yeah, this will do. Here we are, just a little rest stop. A couple of k's out of town. A couple of trees for Nerb sign. Which trees are you going to use, Nerb? Hey. These two? This one to that one. Done. The hammock life. Yeah. Check out that sunset. I set up my little... I don't really have anything to set up. I'm just throwing my vivi out somewhere. And I'm done. So, uh, Craig here has given me this uh, M... That says M-U-C. M-U-C, Military Utility Cloth. Military Utility Cloth. And he says, I just need to add a few drips of water on just it. Just oh. add water. Bang! Whoa! Put a little bit more. <laughs> That's it. And then just I'll unfold it now. Yeah. Wow! And that is a... Whoa! Oh, it's like a bandage. Yeah. <laughs> like a little tablet. So cool. Like a little kind of wet one. You can clean your face. Wow. I'd like to see the machine that compresses yeah. those into... I wanted to do that to my sleeping tablet. bag. If you've got your pockets stuffed with them and you fall over in a lake... You'll, <laughs> you'll just explode. <laughs> <laughs> Lightweight cooking, guys. Titanium pot. Continental stroganoff. This is the best. Packs out really small. Just add a little bit of water. Piece of cake. Chuck that in the fire. And in five minutes, you got yourself... Pastry meal.